Okay guys, back with another video for you on the 1200 paper Gomex Fly Titanic. I um, was able to get all of these plates glued on last night with the help of my daughter. And went to Hobby Lobby and picked up some markers. I actually found that this one is... Sunset Orange is actually closer to the color than the red. Um, so what I've been doing is just doing a line across the seam and then taking a spoon and working it. Kind of flattens out the paper and kind of moves it in a little bit closer. The markers do have kind of a gloss finish, so I'm going to have to spray this with a matte finish. I'm going to try using this one here, Krylon Flat Crystal Clear. That's what I'm going to try on it. But you can kind of see how it's a little bit glossier than the rest. I did up here use clamps on that edge there but I'm liking the look of it so far and I'm just gonna keep going at it get the seams on this lower part taken care of and then we'll probably start doing the decks and then we'll finish putting the black side pieces on it. Let me show you guys a close up here. Hardest part is from like here to here because if you remember there's a side piece that's that goes along here. Back here there's really no support. This is just um, wrapped around the rib but once you get back to here it gets easier because you have support you have support all the way across and then back here once again no support so these are what are going to be your hardest pieces to put on these ones are easy but um, I can't stress enough like getting everything just spot on when you're framing these ribs and everything. Um, I did have, I was probably, the span of it, I was about an eighth of an inch off and somewhere about starting here, when I'd put the pieces on, I had to cut a little square tab and glue it to the rib so that it would have something to hold on to otherwise it would just be free floating so I had to do that on a couple of these sections because these seams I believe are supposed to line up halfway on the rib that's running so if you look for instance here's a good example you can see how these ribs are the piece that comes up they're centered on it so they each get a little bit of support but cutting out those little tabs with just a little bit of cardstock seemed to help. I'm not sure how it's going to affect the rest of the model, but shouldn't be too big of a deal. Really, all it did was in a few spots there might be a little bit of a bulge from the extra cardstock. But I'll keep working away at this and hopefully be back for another video for you.